Our journey into the western desert was a success for Lotus. The priests of Amun have accepted me as the son of Ra. Since you served me so well, I am appointing you commander of the Companion Cavalry. Surely I am the luckiest man on earth to have you as my friend and my king. I can think of no greater honor in life. We are at the beginning of a great adventure, my friend. The wide world awaits us. Hail, sire. Our scouts report that Persian Emperor Darius has assembled his troops near a village called Gagamela. Unless we meet him and crush his forces there, all your conquests thus far will be in vain. Give the order when you are ready to march, Craterus. Our goal is to defeat Darius and seize the tomb of Xerxes in Persepolis. Hello and welcome everybody. This is the finish line, the final scenario in the Greek campaign. Thank you for joining me. Um, <laughs> I haven't done this in a very long time. Um, I know there's a lot of battles in this one. And, okay. I want to have a, a pretty balanced army composition. So we've already upgraded our companions to max stats. Where should I go? We probably should upgrade our javelins since we have them. Range would hurt. Range is always a good option. Uh, cavalry archers, I'm just not. Or cherry archers, I'm not fond of. And horsemen, obviously, are really good archer counters. So I want to have a balanced army. So what we're gonna do? Actually, let me just check something really quick. Can we build siege? Yes, my lord. Okay, we can finally build siege. We can also build a coliseum. Wonderful. Um, yes. Also, can we get resources? What will where should I go? Oh, to victory! Cavalry! Let's do some scouting. To victory! Where is our siege? Okay, let's see if we can build a more siege workshop yes, first and foremost. Yes. As you wish. Scouts. I'm gonna put you guys on the floor. As you wish. We are a little bit low on resources, but I think we can like village some villagers and get more. As you wish. If I'm not mistaken. As Alexander again plunged into Asia, he knew he had to plan carefully. Citizens in Gaza could provide food and lumber for his campaign, but gold and iron would be harder to come by. He would have to plunder what he needed from the cities he conquered. Craterus and Philotus would be yes. indispensable to him during this operation. If either fell Xerxes. before the tomb of Xerxes had been seized, disaster would result. Behold, an indigenous village. Alexander saw two options. He could destroy their town center, construct a settlement, and then turn it into a town center of his own. Or he could plunder the village, raising all the buildings to look for gold or iron. Both had merits, but which to choose? Behold, an indigenous village. Alexander saw two options. He could destroy their town center, construct a settlement, and then turn it into a town center of his own. Or he could plunder the village, raising all the buildings to look for gold or iron. Both had merits, but which to choose? So I'm going to, um, okay, we can build stone throwers, and I've made a big deal yes, out of these throughout this campaign of how much I hate them, and now I can build them. And I believe they count... I'm just gonna build three of them because they're really good. Which do javelins cost? Javelins are gold. Um, well, we're gonna upgrade our ranged infantry, that's for sure. My lord Alexander, the natives speak of a great Persian vassal city called Babylon, a citadel of great wealth and beauty. Perhaps there are stores of resources in Babylon for us to plunder. Sure there are. Um, so I believe these guys count as field cannons, so what we're gonna do since we can find
finally build siege. Let's see if that works. Yes. Okay. Range. Um, speed would be nice. Range and attack and infantry range. We're also going to do range and attack for them. I'm not going to build any ships for the rest of this campaign. So, cavalry sword. We'll get the attack bonus. Alright, so 165 points. That's pretty good. And we'll give them 7 range. And we'll fill the rest of our army combat with archers. And then we'll max out spearmen. And that should be enough because we're going to raise one of these. I don't even know what we get. I know we get resources, which we need. Yes, Milo, as you wish. So these stone throwers, if they're used properly, are extremely devastating. So I just need to be extra careful. And friendly fire isn't that big of a deal because it's our own friendly fire. Where should I go for honor and glory? So we're gonna go Your over... Order. Oh, shit, speed on these things. These things are so slow. Your orders? We're just gonna have Your to wait for them to just pray. lumber over while the rest of the army runs around. These indigenous people have been wiped out, and the plunder from their homes has been delivered to I Alexander's go? war chest. Okay, so the other one, As you we're going to take our villagers, we're going to go put a town center on. Let it be known that Alexander the Greatest just got a list of groups on this villager. And uh, we're going to construct some catapults. Expensive. Ugh. I think we can just get away with. You know what? I'm gonna do this. 
It's those. I hate how much spirit we have. Really... Well, I mean, archers we have are stone throwers to deal with. Archers are just useless versus stone throwers. So as long as we micro properly, it should be fine. Where should I go for honor and glory? For the throne! Okay, hold on. I want you Where all to I see. I do this right. The power of the stone throws. Actually, I can area of attack with these, so we're gonna do this. <laughs> yeah, baby! I'm so excited. Yeah, just wrecked. Get out of here, deleted. Where should I go? Get off my oh, screen. Yes, yeah, you wish. Well, I mean, I love them when oh, I can orders. control them, but I hate them when I can't. Okay, so that should be their entire little BSRB. So we're going to ally with the Hill Tribes, just like what Tyrion Lannister did. Yeah. Since they're in the Copper Age. Oh no. Okay, hey. We don't want to kill all the villagers. It's supposed to be a peaceful acquisition. Stop, please. This is a peaceful acquisition. You guys are burning it over here. For honor and glory. For the truth. Where should I go? For honor and glory. For order. Cavalry. Forward. Your order. New city has been founded in the yes. wilderness. Oh, Greek wow. civilization is spreading across the land. Alexander's campaign goes well. Okay, and we got a bunch of civ points. Um, so what we're gonna do with those civ points is we're going to increase the speed on our stone throwers since they're dragging my entire army down. Okay, that's much better. Your orders. It's going to help exponentially. Catapults are still slow as molasses, but what do you do? I wonder if it would have got worse if points if it took. Where should oh, I go? And glory. What do you do? And I didn't build any shot cap like a dumb dumb. It's alright. Where should I go? Alright, so let, uh, we have a decent army now, let's uh, I really wish I could do more exploring. Okay, we have tons of food. Yes. Oh, we got their villagers. Nice. Certainly. Yes, me lord. As you wish. I'll send you exploring villagers to go to the farms. Yes. Certainly. Oh, this catapult. Taking its Where sweet should I time. Go? Your orders for honor and glory. Actually, I wonder if we should take out Babylon first. For honor and glory. Cavalry forward. To victory. Cavalry forward. For honor and glory. Cavalry. Then we could just face the Persians with like a fully upgraded army and stuff. For the truth. For honor and glory. Fully upgraded stone throwers. Heck yeah. Whoa! Oh, those are medieval age units. Yeah, look at that. 29 attack, 400 health. That's a lot. Oh, 
We are under attack from horsemen, like none we have seen before. Who are these warriors from deep in the heart of Asia? Your orders? They are medieval swordsmen at the moment, which will probably one-shot our archers. Thanks. Um, okay. Stone doors. I'm gonna need you to move up. Let's see what we got here. Ouch! They even hurt my companions. Oh god, friendly fire. Where should I go? I was like, oh, I'm not gonna worry about friendly fire. Silly. Where should I go? A lot of phalanxes. I guess that's pretty can. Ooh, cataphracts. Where should I go? Moorish cavalry. Yeah, that's that's. Where should I go? <laughs> the eighth century cavalry have teleported again back to the future to 335 BC. Seems Where should I go? Oh shoot! Power! Those were dark ages. But they have stand no chance for these stone doors. <laughs> Alright, we lost a handful there, but we're facing, like, Dark Age and Medieval units, so we don't have to worry too much Where should it. I go? Honor and glory. Oh, crud. No, 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 no! We're out of position! Babylonian oh, army oh, is vanquished and the Your ancient orders? city has surrendered. Babylon's great treasury belongs to Alexander, but he must personally go into the city to secure it. You know what I suspect is we're going to get ambushed. Your orders for the Your orders. Your orders for the food. So we're going to build a. Um, where should I go? Some horsemen after this, I think. Your orders? Let's we heal. Because I really don't feel like getting Your honor and ambushed. Glory. Cavalry, forward! Where should I go? The Babylonians have surrendered the Imperial Your Persian orders? treasury Honor to you, my lord. Your coffers have been replenished. Alright. Um I'm gonna upgrade catapult speed because they're slow and annoying. There we go. Where should I go? On the food. So um let's be careful here. That's so expensive, but it's so good. We have four stone throwers. So we're gonna do that. Your orders, oh. honor, and glory. And we're gonna fill out population and then we'll upgrade. So we'll use some of these. We have plenty of companions. Your orders? I'm gonna upgrade feelings. And we're gonna fill out with archers. Actually, it's more javelin to her. Wait, I want to upgrade javelin range. Olympus, your orders? They seem to have done pretty well, so I don't really want to throw them away. Your orders?
Your orders, oh. honor, and glory. So let's um go to this. Where should I go? Right place. For the throne. There's so many save points. 180, 190. That is ridiculous. Like we can Your literally. I've already upgraded glory. all my main light units to max. What I should be doing to be efficient is to like build barracks as well. Yes. The brain is AFK. Certainly. So marching them all Your the way across. Orders. But they have speed bonuses, so it's K. Okay. Where should I go? Um, we're just gonna upgrade you guys to full, I guess. I mean we're gonna be max pop. <laughs> that is sexy. Eight range for storm tours. Where should I go? Oh, the we have a mobile army now. Yeah, it doesn't look like we. I don't think there's any more indigenous villages that we can plunder, take over, or whatever. Kalos. Okay, so we're max pop. Boop. Should I'm I gonna actually upgrade. For honor and glory. I'm just gonna keep focusing on stone throwers, honestly. Cause I really Where should I go? am hoping that they'll carry us. Where should I go? They have eight range, and I you, you saw what they do. Like with four of them with eight range, I can literally take out an entire squadron of archers. I mean, we don't even really need these horses. I guess I could just put you on Explorer. All, the all over the place. Yes, certainly. So we're just going to, um... As you wish. Certainly. So we'll be able to reinforce with hot lights if things go bad, which I don't expect them to. Where should I go? For honor this is and a pretty go. good army comp. Like, this is our most balanced oh. army comp yet. I'm going to leave this catapult back because it's basically worthless. Pitch battles. The stone. I'm gonna try to set up a trap that I've done before. We might not even need to. Like with four stone throwers, should be fine. Your orders are honor and glory. Okay, is that all of our military? Where should I go? For the throne. Dauda. For honor and glory. Let's go get ready to face the Persian army. Um, ah, we have come upon the Imperial Persian army, Ooh, led by the hopes. Emperor Darius and his top commander, General Bessus. Men, Oof. to battle! But we have destroyed half of their forces, my lord. I've no doubt they will break and run as they did at Granicus River. Alright, I'm gonna use you to be bait again. Fuck, let's just, I wanna see what they have. I, I don't wanna. I'm really reluctant to send the stone throwers in first, though. What does the main line have? Spearman? Yuck. Oh, you all see what <laughs> stone throwers can do to spearmen. Ooh, composite archers. That's good. <laughs> Actually, that is good. What's their range? What the heck? They're shooting me from like way far away. Come on. Come on over here, boys. I got a little present for you. Come on. Come on. You know you want to. Come on. Just a little bit closer. Oh, this is so overpowered. Alright, hold on a second. My phone. I keep leaving my phone. I need to put it away. Excuse me. Alright. 
Alright, now I'm gonna see if I can get the spearmen. What I want them to do is I'm gonna actually have Philodus uh, stand still. This is so cheeky. Alright. Alright, so I'm gonna have him turn around like right here. Watch this. <laughs> this is so diabolical, I love it! This is war proper warfare here. Where should I go? He's pretty beat up. Let's just go ahead and send you in there now. Hey, boys! Ouch! Wow, they hurt! Oof! Woof! We have broken the morale of the Persian army! They are running from their colors! Now, we must decide whether to pursue them immediately, or rebuild our strength before engaging them again. Well, we don't have any... We're full pop caps, what, are, what else are we gonna do? Chase them. So we lost one man. Because of our stupid stone growers. Like, like, I'm sure y'all are tired, at least those of you who've watched this, are tired of hearing me complain about not having stone throwers and to fight them. Now you know why. For honor and glory. Like this is on hard difficulty. Even with modifiers that make them do 50% less damage, they still clap. For honor and glory. Oh, where's our catapult? Wonderful. Useful. We killed a bunch of their Persian cavalry. So even the, the mighty Persian cavalry, which are For at age higher than us, can't st don't stand a chance. So yeah, they say they're overpowered. Okay, um, pathfinding, hello? Oh, Tigris and Euphrates, so if we go... <laughs> I don't know what we're doing, my geography has failed me. What? What are they doing? Can we not go okay. over here? Hello? Like, I'm pretty sure I saw the Persian army run this way. Um... Okay... Okay, they retreated across this way. And I don't know why we're going this way. My lord Alexander, we have pursued the retreating Persian army to a great defile, which is heavily fortified. We are awaiting your orders. Beyond this mountain pass lies the city of Persepolis, capital of the Persian Empire. Alexander's conquest of Persia will not be complete until he enters the city in triumph. Your orders? Darius. Ouch! Okay, so stone throwers actually do a fair amount of damage versus buildings, but not like the catapult, obviously.
can snipe them. No, it's not letting me shoot over. That's annoying. No, 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 no. Okay, elephants are coming. Quick! Hi! Run! himself.
goes to the map. Alexander of Macedon is now overlord of Asia. When Persepolis has been captured, the entire Persian Empire will be his. All hail the King of Kings, Alexander. What are we even going to upgrade? I guess we could upgrade Siege more. Um... Infantry range. There, we can upgrade javelin speed. I don't even know what else we can do. It's 200 save points. For honor and glory. Uma. For honor and glory. We have to knock Perry. down another gate. For honor and no, glory. there's more Persians. For the throne. No, done. Wait, 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 wait. Where should I go? Where should I go? No, 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 ah! no, they're not allowed to have stone throwers. Oh, there's a tower. And they're all jammed up on this mountain pass, which is lame. Your catapult is just gonna shove its way through. Oh, 
honor and glory. Where should I go? It's just a giant. What will you? Game of babysitting, honestly. Where should I go? For Babysit the my units. Your orders for honor and glory. Okay. Where should I go? We're so close to victory. For the food. But pathfinding sucks, and I can't trust my units for to do it. Like they're all Your orders? Like the formations are so Where wonky. Where should I go? Honor oh. and glory. Where should I go? Come on. Your orders. Let's go. Your orders. Where should I go? Your orders. Where should I go? Your orders? Where should I go? Your orders? Right, should I go? Your orders? Where should I go? Your orders? Where should I go? Alexander's troops have smashed the army at Persepolis. As the mop-up of enemy resistance continues, Alexander must ride to the tomb of Xerxes inside the city. Capturing that symbol of Persian might will be his crowning achievement. Your orders? Let's heal all of our units in case there's any tomfoolery that goes on. Just OP. He heals so fast too. Just boop, boop, boop. Just top everybody off. Pop out the flash heals. Shh. It's like a paladin. Flash heal. Flash heal. All right, that's everybody. Where should I go? For the throne. Ooh, our infantry command is very beat up. Alexander has entered Persepolis. Once he seizes the tomb of Xerxes, a hundred years of Greek humiliation will finally be reversed. For honor and glory. Toma. Let's get everybody Your in here. Your orders for honor and glory. So where should I go? This team is going to be like an ambush or something, I bet. Your orders? Where should I go? For the Your orders? Your orders? For honor and glory. For honor and glory. For honor and glory. Everybody together. Your orders? Is this the tomb of Xerxes? Where's the tomb of Xerxes? Where should I go? Cavalry, forward! For honor and glory. For the throne! The last. For the throne! For honor and glory. For the throne! This is the Temple of Zeus. For honor and glory. Ah, oh, here's the two of Xerxes. Okay. For honor and glory. This is it, boys. What will Kingdoms will fall. To victory. Olympus the Kingdoms speaks. will fall. Your command. Where Your should I go? For honor and Assassins. Yet another treacherous plot to take Alexander's life has come to life. He must make certain the conspirators are all sent to the grave. And they were. The assassins are dead, and the tomb of Xerxes has been captured. Alexander's triumph in Western Asia is now complete, though darkened by one realization. Philotus, the commander of the Companion Cavalry, was part of the conspiracy. This once trusted friend must now be put to death. The path of greatness is never an easy one. History claims Alexander wept when he had no more lands to conquer. But perhaps, as he stood alone at the height of his power, there was another reason behind the tears. All right, 
so that is the Greek campaign. And we're going to be moving on to the English campaign after this. Which is, um, I would say more entertaining and less entertaining at the same time. You'll see. But, um, yeah, kind of the last week I've done the last one of these because I wanted to get through this one because I really want to get to the German and the Russian campaigns, which I think are the most fun. But I do like the Greek campaign, at least the latter part of it. And, um, thank you all for watching. It's been a lot of fun. Like, um, like I could just, I've, I've played a lot of Empire Earth just by myself with nobody watching and that's fine and dandy and it's fun, but it's kind of cool to just post this like on social media or, you know, I, I really I really feel like I'm wrapping this saga up by putting it online where I just, and those of you who watch who enjoy it, like I'm hoping that there's a few of you who come back and who have nostalgia and come and watch this. And I hope my commentary was adequate. Like, I know I complain a lot, especially about stone throwers, but um, overall, it's pretty fun. And um, yeah, so thank you all for watching, and we'll be moving on to the English campaign next. And y'all have a good day.